Well, several young entrepreneurs can now live and work in a home that will help bring their startup businesses to fruition. What do they all have in common? Well, they're all either students or alumni at the University of Maryland. Living together, that makes a difference. It's living together, being able to bounce ideas off each other, the whole community of it's perfect for entrepreneurs. Brett Potter's company, Readybox, recently built the world's fastest 3D printer. Now it's creating 3D parts to strap onto existing technology. He develops his projects at a University of Maryland lab, but lives among a group of young entrepreneurs. It's called the Startup Village. Five people have lived in this college park house since January. Another five are in the process of moving in next door right now. Both are managed by the same person. Everyone pays a, a rent, someone renting at any, any other house. The only difference is there's a community here. So you have the community that you can you know, rely on for your businesses. Everyone works in their businesses in the house. We do community service projects together. We do dinners together every few weeks. And we also bring in speakers, people from the local community, successful business owners, just different ways that everyone can really grow their companies and help one another um, as their companies really you know, move forward. So right here you have um, a car, and one of the members of Startup Village um, is a mechanic. And so what he does is he helps fix cars of, of members, and he also takes parts off old cars and then sells them online and also puts them on his own car. Engold not only manages the two properties, which house 10 student entrepreneurs, he also has three other businesses, including a food truck, a mobile ice cream cart, and a high-end used clothing business. We've got a late kid in there, so we've got a uh, late off, two lates actually. Uh, one off to the left, one off to the right, so I'm trying to like bounce it out so not too many crazy shadows going all over it. Michael Malcolm also lives in the house. He's the director of the Startup Shell. Our goal is to accelerate the, the process of student entrepreneurship, um, help businesses, you know, either get their feet on the ground if they've just started, you know, set up their LLC, figure out some legal things, uh, and build their team, help them with whatever, whatever it may be, web development or legal aid. Um, we're basically like just a hub of, uh, of resources for, for students, for student entrepreneurs on campus. Some of the startups are well on their way to becoming successful businesses. JavaZen, a one-of-a-kind hybrid that combines the energy of coffee with the health benefits and flavor of tea, recently won the $80,000 grand prize in a competition hosted by Under Armour founder Kevin Plank, who is also a UMD graduate. And for more information on the program, you can visit StartupVillage.com.